Uh, I woke up one day and uh, I just I just had something in my you know my heart that I felt like I just needed to say something and you know I, I asked the older older boys for their you know for their for their thoughts of a young guy speaking and you know they all ran me with that that time to you know give me the opportunity to talk and you know I thank them for trusting me you know even though I'm a I'm a sophomore uh, thank you thank you to them and the coaches for trusting me and, and uh, allowing me to say something. Yeah, uh, I mean growing up it was a uh, you know I wasn't very uh very loud or talkative uh, like that, you know, but, you know, big props to my dad for always, uh, and my family really for always just letting me know like, hey, you have a, you have a voice and it's powerful and you know, you gotta, gotta keep using it. Like I said, God, God gifted me with a lot of talents and, you know, you gotta use it. I, I think I remember JT, our, our DN, he, uh, he uh, stood in the middle of us before our, one of our first practices and basically told us like, hey, you know, there's still a possibility. Um, let's not feel sorry for ourselves. Let's try to get better today. So um, those practices ended up being pretty good practices, to be honest. Um, after, you know, JT, you know, stood up, young guy stood up and, and expressed how he was feeling uh, about our possibility to play in the college football playoffs still. So uh, we, we we ended up having pretty good practices, even though, you know, coming in, it kind of, you kind of feel the, you know, the the downness from all the players in the locker room before we uh, put the pads on and came out here, but ended up being two really good days of practice. Before our practice, he just gave a speech to us and just telling us, like, uh, don't worry about the past. You know, we got the chance to go in here uh, and play in the college playoffs. So, you know, it's an amazing chance, and we just got to take the opportunity and just run with it.